Now you'll notice that I'm beaming a little bit extra at this moment, because in 2018, the Global Citizen Festival was hosted on African soil for the very first time. And they were in my home, Mzansi, South Africa. Clap for that. You there go. <laughs> now the festival was there to honor the legacy of Uma Diva with Mandela 100 and kicking off a brand new tradition. Cisco and Global Citizen teamed up to create the Cisco Youth Leadership Award to recognize a young person who was positively impacting the world by using innovative technology. And I was there to witness it all. A true full circle moment. But of course, in true Global Citizen fashion, another full circle moment, because today South Africa is celebrating Freedom Day. <laughs> Standing next to this incredible woman presenting you. this award. Thank you. <laughs> that is amazing. And I'm so proud to say that this is our fifth year honoring individuals who are working to end extreme poverty and positively impact the planet in the most groundbreaking ways. Tonight, we'll meet this year's recipient. But first, let's take a look at previous award winners. Get ready. <laughs> The Cisco Youth Leadership Award was established by Cisco and Global Citizen to celebrate the power of vision. Our purpose is to power an inclusive future for all. Throughout history, the passion of youth has been a catalyst for change. There is something revolutionary about how a young person sees things. Today I would like you all to imagine a world free of suffering and disease. And it is my life's mission to make it possible. Be open to ideas and adapt. Now this is Global Citizen. Thank you so much for this incredible honor. Thank you so much. Thank you everyone. Wow. Change begins with us. What an incredible group of young leaders. And tonight, we are so excited to welcome a new visionary leader into this group. This year's Cisco Youth Leader Award winner is preparing the next generation of students in Zimbabwe for the future by providing them with the STEM education in new and affordable ways. By using emerging technology, he has created an immersive experience that allows students in underfunded schools to get a hands-on science education virtually. I mean, this kind of out-of-the-box solution creates opportunities for children to put them to pull themselves, their families, and communities out of poverty. So, let's meet Kosana Butulenkosi Masuku. My name is Kosana Butulenkosi Masuku. I'm the founder of Science Learning. Science was started because I realized when I was teaching at rural areas, it was difficult for students to comprehend practical science subjects. This was due to lack of materials. The aim of science is to provide low-cost, practical, and hands-on STEM and robotics education to students in undeserved areas. We've established the Maker Labs, which allow students to come in here and learn innovative courses like robotics, which propel them to be problem solvers in the future. The long-term advantages of learning practical hands-on STEM education is that it allows learners to retain their knowledge and thereby reducing the dropout rates. We need young people who can be critical innovators. My hopes for the kids that I'm teaching is that they become the next generation of people who are young innovators and can develop solutions to our problems in the community. It is important for students to be able to grasp those new concepts which will allow them to elevate into newer fields. One day I want to build my own robots that can change, that can change people's lives in the future. I chose robotics so that I could make an iPhone or something more than an iPhone and I could be a role model to some people in life. 
I'm super thrilled by winning the Cisco Youth Leadership Award because this means that our learners in Zimbabwe will get to experience more advanced technological hands-on STEM education and will continue to impact thousands of learners as we expand our mission and our services across the region. Okay, please welcome the 2023 Cisco Youth Leadership Award recipient, Kusana Butulenkosi Masuku. Winning this award is not just a personal achievement for me. It's a testament to the tireless work that our team at Science has been doing to provide practical STEM education to students in undeserved communities. This award will go a long way in helping us expand our work, reach more students, and make a bigger impact. We believe that every child deserves education and quality STEM education, and this award is a step forward in our mission to break the cycle of poverty. However, there's still so much work for us to, done, to be done. And extreme poverty remains uh, a harsh reality for millions of people and improved access to quality education is a crucial component in ending the cycle. As we celebrate this award, I call on all of us to advocate for quality STEM education and to ensure that every child has the opportunity to reach their full potential and make a positive impact in their community. Thank you for this incredible honor. I look forward to working together towards a brighter future, more equitable for all. Thank you very much. <laughs> 